Hey there, everybody. Welcome back to the Playing Trains and Comic Books channel. My name is Matt, and today we're going to review Flash number 790. But before we get into that, if you guys wouldn't mind like, sharing, subscribing, commenting, it really helps me out and lets me know what you guys want to see more of. So with that being said, let's get straight into it. All right, we got the cover here for The Flash number 790. It is a DC comic. It is by Adams, Cruz, Bannings, Diaz, and Guerrero. And we start off on the first page with some aliens known as the Fraction. They are planning some kind of attack on Earth. And they're talking about how they've conquered many, many different worlds. So obviously they're not very good guys. Then we get to Wally West and his family. Everything seems to be going great with their relationship and their marriage. Then we cut to outside the house, and they're in the middle of having a party with a bunch of their other super friends. All of a sudden, there's a loud noise, and they look up and see something in the sky. Then we cut to downtown, where Jenny Quick and her husband, Our Man, are fighting a couple bad guys. And they're making pretty quick work of them. And just when it looks like they're about to win, and Jenny is winding up to hit this lion guy with this metal pole, all of a sudden, everything freezes. The bad guy is still hovering in thin air. Her husband, Our Man, is moving in fact no one downtown is moving in the streets except that because she's part of the flash family and she can move really fast she is able to move around without issue then we cut to barry allen who's on a date with iris and they're talking about their future and iris actually pulls out a little box and she proposes to barry allen but before he has a chance to answer he realizes that everybody's frozen just like the bad guys that jenny quick was fighting and then he hears a really loud noise coming from outside, and that's where we're going to stop it. I don't want to spoil anything else. So The Flash has been one of my favorite books for the last year or so. I think Adams is doing a great job building up Wally West with his family again, and really making you care about these characters. And this is actually the beginning of a new story arc called The One Minute War. And The Flash is actually going to be coming out weekly, so we don't have to wait too long for this story to really pick up and get moving. With this issue in particular, I really love the story, the way Adam showed each of the different Flash family members, either fighting crime or spending time with their significant others, and then the effects of what's about to happen with this alien attack. And I gotta say, this attack is brutal. I'm not gonna spoil what exactly happens, but it actually left me kind of shocked. I thought the art was pretty good. To me, it wasn't anything like super special, but it definitely got the job done and it was just solid and consistent throughout. This is a great time to jump onto The Flash. This book doesn't sell as much as it should and I really think more people should be reading it. So I'm gonna give this book a 4.5 out of five. So if you saw anything you like, definitely go pick that up at your local comic book store and we will see y'all in the next one.